Obaiwai the second who convoked the meeting of the palace chiefs, the Enige, the Ediowere, the chief priests and the priestesses, as well as the native doctors and other groups of people, decried the art of illegal migration, human trafficking, by forcing migrants to take secret oaths, cultism, kidnapping, and the community development associations in Benin said, the vices are at variance with the rich cultural heritage for which the Benin kingdom is reputed for. The Benin monarch therefore decreed that causes be placed on the perpetrators of these crimes if they refuse to retrace their steps from these social ills by the chief priests, priestesses, and the native doctors in the land. Some of the palace chiefs and the zonal commander of Napti Benin, Ndoka Wanwime, described the step taken by the Oba of Benin as a welcome development, adding that it will go a long way in stemming the tide of this ugly trend in the state. We were getting a bit ashamed. Now uh, people understand what they were doing to us. We hope this is the end of it all. The illegal migration and the trade, let me say trade of human beings they were involved on, going through Libya and the rest of them. We've been talking, let us have been talking to them, but they didn't know what it is. But from now, they will know the efficacy of what has happened today, that there has never been a doubt for those who refuse to obey it. This is the right step in the right direction. Uh, CVA and some other societal aids that have been going on for some time, the Monoba today has decreased against them. And not only decreed, uh, passing a decree, he has also put the repercussion. So no one in his right senses will disobey. What you see here today was a total den you know, denunciation, total denunciation of such um, uh, negative activity uh, by those of us who have uh, facilitated and indulged in this embarrassing, disgraceful practice. Now that His Royal Majesty has placed a curse on those that we perpetrate or taking, then, of course, our job is half done because we'll be able to do our cases very well, we'll be able to rescue victims, and the incidence of human trafficking will be greatly minimized. Recall that human trafficking and illegal migration by some syndicates who force their victims to engage in secret oath taking using some native doctors so as not to reveal their secrets have assumed the dangerous dimension of late thereby attracting the public outcry. In the end, Steve Lona and Waukolo, NTA News.